G'day, night time here. Uh, just down here in Glenelg, um, possibly meeting up with the Angry Aussie from Melbourne. While he's down here before he heads back for uh, Great Ocean Road, I think it is. So let's uh, have a look around Glenelg. Okay, here I am in Glenelg, um, Mosley Square, under a nice shady palm tree, Hobbs and McDonald's, waiting for people to show up for the uh, for the lunch. Just borrowing uh, McDonald's Wi-Fi, just to uh, check my email and so forth. So here we are, still in uh, Glenelg, had I've met up with uh, Angry Aussie and Tom. Uh, I'll give you a bit of a look and see uh, So, there we go, that's who showed up, there's Angriotti and many other people, which I can't quite identify at the moment. <laughs> yeah, let's do a bit of a quick look around where I'm standing. That's the group back there, I think. Okay, here we go. Just, Ellie, just, just, wait a sec, Corey. Ready? Ellie says the only reason Corey can break an apple is because American apples are soft, and Corey thinks he can do it. So here we go. Right. Australian apple versus American. Here we go. <laughs> that doesn't include. That doesn't include. <laughs> there you go. I split it. <laughs> We've stopped after the Cold Rock Ice Creamery, the 
uh, some of the guys are getting some ice cream from there. Give you a bit of a look. temporarily to uh, watch the volleyball. Nothing much was happening, so we're wandering back up to uh, Bosley Square. See if there's anything more interesting going on over there. Catch up with you soon today. We're on the great sunglass hunt for uh, Corey. So, try a few shops, so it doesn't seem to find anything he likes yet. So, let's uh, have a closer look. Some sunglasses for Corey. You smell the delectable aroma of chocolate but just across the road. So we pop it in and check this out. Now that's why I've got a chocolate fountain. See you soon. <laughs> Definitely enough here to satisfy anyone's uh, chocolatey desires. <laughs> I better get myself out of here before I uh, So we're here in the um, Glenelg Historical Museum. It uh, documents uh, the history of Glenelg, uh, some maritime houses, homes, what you find on the beach, things like that. So let's have a bit of a look. Can you me? Uh, 
Oh. Cool. That's like sideways to you. We're at the end of the day with uh, Angry Aussie and, and friends. They're about to leave. Probably. There we go. Yeah, they just uh, fire up the car, put the air conditioner on, keep it cool, and then they're off. They're leaving Adelaide tomorrow, or along the ocean road up to Melbourne. And you'll probably see a uh, video of that uh, sooner or later. Alright, I'm going to sign off. See you later.